Here's the first of the day, fellas. To old D.H. Lawrence. Indians. Yeah, now all you have to do is hold the chicken, bring me the toast, give me a check for the chicken salad sandwich, and you haven't broken any rules. You want me to hold the chicken, huh? I want you to hold it between your knees. <laughs> you see that sign, sir? Yes, you all have to leave. I'm not taking any more of your smartness and sarcasm. You see this sign? You have to ask me nicely. You see, Danny, I can deal with the bullets and the bombs and the blood. I don't want money and I don't want medals. What I do want is for you to stand there in that faggoty white uniform and with your Harvard mouth extend me some fucking courtesy. You gotta ask me nicely. This is not an Indian. This is not an Indian type. And you see this car here, this big black car? This is not a truck. This is not a maroon truck like Wadna drove. This is a big black station wagon. And these right here, these, according to an interview I had with a girl named Beck, 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 Betsy Fiss. I'm gonna kick your ass around the block for drill, man. You try it and I'll call the shore patrol. I am the motherfucking shore patrol, motherfucker! I am the motherfucking shore patrol! Now give this man a beer. I don't want a beer anymore. You're gonna have a fucking beer! Come on, man! I feel like one right now. Yes. Come on, man. Well, my compliment to you is... The next morning, I started taking the pills. I don't quite get how that's a compliment for me. You make me want to be a better man. I don't want to nail you. I want to find out who put you up to it. I'll give you a few days to think about it. Call me, I can help. Who knows? Maybe we can put the whole thing off on a few big shots and uh, you can stay the head of the department for the next 20 years. And then a bunch of weird creatures came out and started trying to take you away. And you want to know what? They all looked like Randall. Do you understand? And I was jumping up trying to save you. Okay, and Dad, then suddenly Dad, I... it's okay. You're just wigging out a little. And well, Mom is not here to calm you down, so... No, this isn't like that. I am begging you, don't marry Randall. This guy is not up to snuff. He's not in your league. I can't let this happen. I will not allow it. As long as I live, she'll never let me forget what happened. I did hurt him once, okay? It was an accident. Completely unintentional. Could have happened to anybody. Chief voted. Now, will you please turn the television set on? Mr. McMurphy, the meeting was adjourned and the vote was closed. But the vote was 10 to 8. The chief, he's got his hand up. Look. No, Mr. McMurphy. When the meeting was adjourned, the vote was 9 to 9. Ah, oh, come on. You're not going to say that now. You're not going to say that now. You're going to pull that hand house shit now. When the vote, the chief just voted. It was 10 to 9. Now, I want that television set turned on right now. Realists.com.